guys and welcome back. Today I'm doing a inspired look off of Mario from Brown Eye Girls new music video Brave New World. I'm going to do like a little mini series and do a look from each member because that video was so amazing and so badass like oh my god the queens are back. I'm in love and I'm in love. So this one is inspired by Medio um, when they're in the car and they're kind of like being taken to another world. Um, I really fell in love with this look that she had. Um, it was really smoky and then but it had like pops of gold in it so I really like that. So this is the look. And I hope you guys will enjoy this little mini series. And uh, yeah, on with the tutorial. Okay, so I started off with a primer and I used the Urban Decay primer potion, just the original one, and I applied it all over the lid, up to the brow and underneath. Um, the brow, I tried to keep it straight but also a little arched. First color I'm going to be using is from my Lorac Pro Palette. And I'm going to use Nectar, which... Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo, Nectar as a transition shade color. Um, it's a very... The look is very smoky, so I really wanted to have something to help transition from the darkest to the light color. So I'm going to start putting that into my crease. Girl, I'm hearing awful things. Now is time you talk to me. Now taking a pencil brush, I'm going to be using Plum from the same palette. And I'm going to be putting that on the inner and the outer corners of my lid, keeping it very straight. Talk to me. Are these dark twisted rumors true? And then I'm going to take a little bit and add it on the lower lash line all the way across. All you do is tell me now for the center, I want a really bright metallic gold. So I'm going to be taking the Maybelline Color Tattoo Pigment in Wild Gold. And I'm going to be mixing it with a mixing medium. Now you don't have to use anything special or expensive. I use eye drops. I got this huge bottle um, for like four bucks and that's all you really need. You can use water but I just find that it doesn't irritate your eyes as much when you use eye drops. And it stays on really well. So I dumped a little bit in the cap, and then I'm going to add one drop, just one doop, and then mix it until it becomes a paste. If you need more, you can add more um, liquid, um, so pretty much like a paste, and then apply it on the very center of the lid where there's no shadow. Let's find out the truth tonight. A little brush and kind of blend it in as well. And then I'm going to take whatever is left over my brush and kind of go over the top of the gold so it'll have a little bit more of a blending effect into the crease. Add some liner and I'm going to be using the Sephora Rio Night waterproof gel eyeliner and a little angled brush like so and then line my waterline with the Doucet Cosmetics Ultra Precision Eyeliner in waterproof black 500 yeah
I'm going to add a duo of mascara and I'm going to use my two favorite, the um, L'Oreal Miss Mongolosh and the Urban Decay Super Curling Mascara. Alright, and now that the eyes are done, I did my face, I just used a BB cream and then a concealer to kind of spot conceal, um, contoured like crazy. And I did like a peachy, shimmery blush. So, that's that. And then I added this kind of leather jacket vest that I have. And a spike collar. And a little, you know, cross earring and some little spikes. So, you know, trying to match her somewhat degree. <laughs> Definitely don't have the long black hair, but I did try to style it. Um, kind of like hers. So she has a really pretty nude lip in the video. So I'm going to use this Tristique, Tristique, I think, mini matte lip crayon in Nantucket Nude. And now for the finishing touch, a lip ring. She has this really cool lip ring on. I only have um, this one that I used to put in my ear. Uh, when I was when I was uh, gauging my ears, so there you go. I think I might actually want to get this actually done in real life. I'm not sure. What do you guys think? Yes, no, maybe I don't know. But that is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed, and definitely stay tuned for more looks from the Brown Eye Girls new music video. Um, Brave New World. It's such a good video and it's really out there and fun and I definitely have to do a look for every single one. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Click subscribe if you have not and like and I will talk to all of you later. Bye!